live, up close, and unplugged. And unplugged. 95 Will Rock's national award-winning Studio East, where rock bands get intimate and strip it down acoustically. You can stream live video of Will Rock Studio East performances at 95willrock.com. Brought to you by the U.S. Army, GoArmy.com, and Mars Cheese Castle on West Frontage Road near Highway 142, Kenosha. Now, let's go live to the 95 Bull Rock Studio East. I'm Leah, and we are live. Some Monday action going on in Studio East. Give it up for Otherwise. Monday fun day, baby. Heck yeah. And let's just start it off right away. Everyone join me in saying Joe. happy birthday no. to Brian. It's Brian's birthday today. Happy birthday, Brian. Yay. Yay. Yeah. Can we sing him happy birthday? Do we have time? Uh, sure. I mean, okay, you guys ready? Uh, Tony's ready? Give him a key. Uh, there you go. Is that cool? Uh, you guys got that? Cool? Uh, happy birthday to Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Brian. Happy birthday to you. And welcome to Studio East because this is your first time here. I promise you that is not the greeting you're going to get every time. But since it is your birthday, I thought we'd do a little something special for you. And day off today, too. So yeah, it's on the come. agenda. Yeah, we're gonna, we might take him into Chicago tonight. He's never been, so. Oh, you've never been to Chicago? Yeah. No. Got to get a pie. Got to get that Chicago pie. Yeah, get, get that deep dish. Deep. Deep dish. <laughs> <laughs> It's Show, his birthday. It's, it is his birthday. <laughs> Show going on tomorrow night, 1175 Sports Park and Eatery. You're on tour right now with Red in 10 Years, who you've toured with separately before. This is the first time all together, though. How's the tour been going it, so it's, far? It's been righteous. It's, I mean, last night's show was awesome. Some people were there last night uh, in, in Joliet. Um, you know, 10 Years are like some of our best friends in the industry. The guys in Red are super cool. And it's just been mind-blowing you know we get to play and the greatest part about this run is that we've actually done some rooms that we haven't gotten a chance to play before like the one tomorrow which is called what again 1175 sports park and eatery okay that's yeah. a long name yes dude. it is it's a mouthful all right is it good food I as an know. eatery tomorrow's actually going to be my first time there too oh boom all right so, so yeah first time for both of us it's been pretty epic this tour has been awesome yeah. and you guys it's been going on for a couple weeks now right it's about a month. About a now. month now, right? Yeah. Yeah. Is this we, the is this the first tour since your new album? Yeah. yeah. Awesome. Yeah. Man. This is the tour in support of Sleeping Lions, our new record, which I hope you guys have. Some of you guys, yes. Mm -hmm. maybe. All right. All right. And then it's also our first album that my brother and I have been fortunate enough to do with Tony and Brian. So. A lot awesome. of firsts. A lot of firsts. Great. So we're going to hear something off the new album first. Yes. Yeah. Studio East. Let's do it. And this one's called Suffer, and this is a, a song about it's okay to not be okay. All right. Find me escaped inside a fear that kills 
me I guess it's all my fault Play the victim through it all So go enjoy your secrets I don't know if I can make a difference all in all we're complicated Out here on our own Devastated, so complicated We're out here alone So never lose your faith It's easier to suffer Than face yourself today The war is far from over It's not over Tony on keys right here, man. Come on. Will Rock Studio East, thanks to the U.S. Army and Mars Cheese Castle, West Frontage Road in Kenosha. Now, you did mention that these guys, Tony and Brian, um, this is the first album since them joining the band. What did they bring to the table as far as that album process? Amazing man buns. Amazing wow. man buns. <laughs> Boom. I mean, you're, rocking a, oh, you're rocking it down, down low. The yeah, down it's like low a bun falling apart. Can't do the That's what it looks like. Right. Well, I mean, honestly, all, all kidding aside, you know, I mean, they're both massively talented. Tony's a multi-instrumentalist. He plays everything from the piano to the flute, if you can believe that. And we'll probably do a flute solo on our next record. Um, <laughs> and then Brian is just one of the... He's, he's easily becoming one of the top-rated drummers in, in modern rock. And besides their musical talent, they have just... They're actually good dudes in, deep down in their cores, you know. And, and my brother and I actually like them for the most part so <laughs> that's that's what they <laughs> that's what they bring for us they've really uh they've kind of reinvigorated our 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 belief in in music and and spreading light yeah a lot of genuine smiles and and really good synergy we're we're working hard out here we feel like we've got uh we started over uh really with this this album yeah. sleeping lions but we're more experienced we have a lot more support and now we have really amazing bandmates, so it's actually a really exciting time for us. Yeah, feels good. Cool. I think on behalf of everyone, you know, we missed hearing from you because it had been a couple of years. Yeah. Um, besides revamping the band, kind of, what else has been going on? Well, I mean, we've we've done a like a whole kind of uh, you know cleaning of house with you know we have new management, new booking, new. Uh, um, uh, new bandmates, obviously, um, but I also have a new son. Oh, congratulations! <laughs> so, yeah, my my son, uh, my my second son was born um, while we were actually tracking the vocals for this this record um, back in February. And that puts a lot of meaning into it. What's that? Like? That puts a lot of meaning yeah, into it. Yeah, and, and it was ironically or synchronistically enough, um, I was doing the vocals for a song called Bloodline Lullaby. And those of you guys who know the album Sleeping Lions, it's kind of like the closing track, and it's all about family and. And you know your your ancestors and your your uh, your next of kin and you know just 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 your clan you know and so um, it I sang those vocals with a lump in my throat and Sahaj Tikatin the, pro the producer and one of the co-writers he uh, he actually chose to use the vocals where I was like 
really emotional Gosh. because he felt that the performance was just priceless. He's like, real? Can't. Yeah, it was real. So when you listen to it, it's 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 the real deal on the record. So. Well, Sleeping Lions is out now in title track. I got to ask you about that. What was that experience like uh, writing that with Jonathan Davis? Well, for Tony, it was very uh, uh, envious because he <laughs> he was he, <laughs> he couldn't go. He couldn't go, but oh, he no. but he uh, but he wrote the riff for Sleeping Lions, and he kind of is like that's like his little baby, his brainchild. And Corn is one of Tony's favorite bands as well as ours. And when my brother and I got the opportunity to go up to to John's studio, um, it was. Tony was just like, what do you say, dude? What's going on? What do you tell you? Like, how was it? Like, what would you talk to him about? I'm like, well, you know, we ate gumbo with him. It was awesome. <laughs> and we actually did eat gumbo with him. His One of his studio techs uh, made some of the best gumbo I've had outside of Louisiana. <laughs> it was pretty awesome. Yeah, John was a really actually sweet guy. And uh, at first, you know, we were like, oh, man, it's Jonathan Davis of Corn. Like, don't look him in the eyes. <laughs> don't look at him. But then, you know, by the end of the session, you know, we were hugging each other and you guys were talking about your kids. And you yeah. know, it was just really crazy because when you're in a uh, writing session, you know, usually you'll put the, the verse on a loop and then we'll sit and whoever's writing melody will just sit and come up with stuff and at one point I looked over and I see Jonathan Davis like sitting there singing singing on the verse I'm like oh my god <laughs> you know it's, this just, it's the lead singer of Korn like singing to one of our songs oh, right yeah. now so it was pretty cool and, and you know the last song we just did Suffer we, we were able to write co-write that with Clint Lowry from Seven Dust so we really we, yeah we really were fortunate you know it make, makes us feel good in what we do that we're respected by these guys that we look up to you know and they I guess we don't suck. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'll clap for that. To That's got to be a good feeling. <laughs> Tomorrow night, show's going on at 1175 Sports Park and Eatery. Going to be there with 10 years. And Red, what are we going to hear from you next? Uh, we're going to do a little, little something special for you guys. We've only done it a couple times. Um, and uh, it's just kind of a, a tribute and a reminder of uh, what we have here in this waking life. So uh, if you guys are Lincoln Park fans, please sing along with us. Man. 
We did that one justice for you guys. Man. Otherwise, live in 95, Will Rock Studio East. Thanks to the U.S. Army in Mars Cheese Castle, West Frontage Road in Kenosha. Show going on tomorrow night. And then the tour is wrapping up. It wasn't that long of a tour. Yeah, it was about a month and a half. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so but it was over You know what? Month. Our run with Red in 10 years. 10 years. Is like four, four oh, weeks. Oh, right, right. But then we have about another week of headlining shows we're going to be oh, doing. Oh, nice. Yeah, We've so. been gone since the, no, October 10th, I think. Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We had like a week leading up and then a, a week after and... Yeah, a lot of cool stops, but I keep hearing about this Mars Cheese Castle. Oh, you have to go. I don't know if we'll have time today. Tony and I got to cut some vocals on a song, but maybe we could take the birthday boy over there. Somebody he can't can... eat yes. dairy. Oh, he can't do dairy, man. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. There's plenty of other things to eat. There what's, um... <laughs> you can't do anything. There's a cake made out of tofu. That was a that's a true statement in that tone and everything. I do have Kringle back there. I don't know if there's any dairy in there. What, Kringles? Yeah, Kringles. There's, is there dairy in them? I don't know. No? There's a big yeah. no on that. Sweet. You can try it out and we'll find I'll, out. I'll, I'll all right, so, I'll deal. so we'll be getting you guys out of here so you can go celebrate his birthday and all. But what's on the agenda for the rest of the year after this tour is um, over? We're trying to put together something for December, a short little run in December. Um, it'll probably most likely, I'm just guessing, be more on the West Coast because okay. it's closer to you know Christmas. We want to get home. Be home by the uh, annual in Vegas. Well, are we going to do the annual holiday yeah, party? We should. We I mean, we, we, usually, we do an annual holiday. It's called the Holiday Hometown Throwdown every year. And uh, we usually, we've done it at the Hard Rock a couple years. We did the House of Blues one year. So this will be the fourth year. Um, so if you guys want to make a trip to Vegas, we <laughs> usually do it between Christmas and New Year's. And it's like a nice little Nice little midway celebration there between the two big holidays. Awesome. So. And if you can't make it out west, you could always go see them tomorrow night, 1175 Sports Park and Eatery. Do we want to hear one more song from them today, guys? Yeah, all right. Hey. Hi. Well, we'll do one more off you. This is uh, actually the bonus track. It got called a bonus track on the record because it made it last minute. Um, and... Uh, it almost didn't get. It almost didn't make the cut. Almost didn't make the cut. Yeah, and, and you know we were fighting for it, and and uh, the reaction from you guys is actually what changed the minds of uh, some of the the decision makers, and um, it fought its way onto the album. That's kind of how. Cool. So we do matter, guys. You yeah. hear that? Awesome. Yeah. All yeah. Right. And this is kind of our, our anthem, and you know our our new our newest fight anthem for the heart. So. Uh, Tell them about our, our banner that we're speaking. Oh, yeah. We also, you know, as part of the tied into the song, you know, obviously you guys know what happened in Vegas about a month ago. And um, we brought this uh, tribute wall. And we kick, we actually kicked this tour off with um, a benefit show for the victims of the Route 91 musical fe music festival. And um, uh, we brought this wall. It's, a, it's like a step and repeat. We're calling it a tribute wall. And we put it up in the venues and we have everybody sign it. And it's like filling up with signatures. And... You know, we're going to take it home and, and present it to the city and just, uh, you know, I guess let everybody in Vegas know that music lovers everywhere, you know, we come together because of music. So if you guys come to the show tomorrow, please sign it and yeah. uh, we'll take it back and let them know that we're That's all amazing. thinking about them. And hopefully those, you know, the good vibrations will find all our better angels out in the universe somewhere. So this song is called Won't Stop. <laughs> so true I'll be eternally wishing I'll always be missing you and I want to thank you for giving a lifetime worth living to me whenever one chapter closes another one opens you'll see Won't stop beating. My heart's broken, but it won't stop beating. There is 
the place that we're heading It might be upsetting to hear But I have to ask you to trust me There really is nothing to fear And I want to thank you for lending A love never ending to me Whenever one chapter closes Another one opens your But it won't stop beating My heart's broken But it won't stop beating I want to feel something I gotta feel something I die to feel something Just to feel it again this isn't the end, this isn't the end, my friend, this isn't the end, I will see you once again. Five years, Will Rock. It's Will Rock's birthday too, right? It's Brian's birthday. We got people watching from all around the country, all around the world, online. 95willrock.com. Let them hear you guys too, all right? We can see you. We feel you. We felt you guys last night. We're feeling you right now. But we let everybody feel you, okay? You guys gonna sing? It's real easy. You already know it. You already know the song. You ready? We'll sing it, and then you sing it back, okay? It's real easy. You already know it, okay? Here we go. Heart's broken, but it won't stop beating. One, two, three, four. Yeah, yeah, we gotta do that again. It's alright. We can do. I gotta do it again too. You guys are getting me all emotional up here, so. You got one more chance, all right? Second chance in life, the most valuable thing. Just like we've got with this record, just like Will Rock keeps supporting us. It's priceless. It's invaluable. Here's your second chance. Here it goes. You ready? Here we go. My heart's broken, but it won't stop beating. Oh. My heart's broken, but it won't stop beating. Yeah. My heart's broken, but it won't stop beating. My heart's broken, but it won't stop beating. I want to feel something I gotta feel something I die to feel something Just to feel it again My heart's broken but it won't stop But it won't stop beating I want to thank you for lending A love never ending to me Whenever one chapter closes Another one opens, you'll see You guys sounded great. Otherwise, live in 95, Will Rock Studio East, thanks to the U.S. Army in Mars, yes. G's Castle, West Frontage Road, and Kenosha, trying to make a stop out there today. It's amazing. Thank you, thank you guys so It was Thank so great you, to see you, and it's yeah. so awesome to hear new stuff from you, so don't be a stranger. Are you going to come to the show tomorrow? Absolutely. Okay, you guys coming to the show tomorrow? Yeah. 1175 right. Sports Park and Eatery tomorrow night. Otherwise, 10 years in red. Thank you, guys, and we'll see yeah. you soon. Hey, Thank once you. this ends, can we just do an extra song for them? Once we close yeah, it? absolutely. Right. You guys want yeah. that? Yeah. You guys want that? <laughs> All right. All right. Live see? in 95, Will Rock Studio East with Otherwise. Yeah. All right. Got to do the break? Right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Are we good? We're done? Can we like cuss now and stuff? No, we might be. <laughs> <laughs> I know it's hard, you know, hold it in. It's rock and roll, baby.
Come on. Can I get this guitar unmuted, please? Are we in spots? Unmute guitar, please. No, he's got, they got to make sure. Oh, okay. Check, check. I think my, hey, by the way, I think my, my wife and my kids are watching. Wow, that's kind of cool.